sleep on that bed so i'll sit over here but anyways y'all i made it to my layover i haven't even talked to y'all really all day but let me um i'm gonna talk to y'all and move because i got things to do but yeah so i am today is day one of a three day i think i told y'all that earlier when i um tried to do my intro and basically i had three legs today so i started of course in atlanta so it was from atlanta to fort lauderdale then fort lauderdale to atlanta and then atlanta to um new orleans where i'm at now so let me sit y'all up real quick so yeah so i'm in new orleans right now and i was excited about this layover because i've had new orleans layover a couple times but i've never had the long stay so this is my first time at the long stay we got here a little later like about an hour later than what we were supposed to because today was all about delays um it started with delays and now of course as y'all can see it ended with delays but i'm not gonna let that hold me back because I kept this trip on my rotation because just because of this layover so I'm about to get ready put some clothes on and then head on out and then I'll come back and talk to y'all you know about everything else but yeah just wanted to hop on and give y'all an update and I'll see y'all in a minute I'm back in my room and it is it's early like it's early as far as like compared to you know party time or whatever because it's like it's only well it's about to be 1 a.m. so I got back probably like 30 minutes ago something like that but um I had a little nice little outing out there I walked I walked um, I think it was Canal Street and then I hit Bourbon Street for a little bit um i got me i went to one of the slushy um not smoothie the 
daiquiri places got me a daiquiri and then i got this food so as soon as i saw this food truck i immediately just stopped and um i ended up getting fish and shrimp fried fish and shrimp and it is so good i'm gonna eat all of it so let me show y'all so i couldn't eat all of it so of course i brought it with me it's too late to finish it but i'm gonna try to finish it tomorrow of course Fried food is never like the same the second day, but I don't waste food at all. So I will definitely be eating it tomorrow. But one of my coworkers hit me up on um, Instagram and she told me about this place that I need to try. It's a, a, not a brunch spot, but a food place. And she was like, I need to try it because they got some really good food. And I was like, bet. So tomorrow I'm gonna try to get up early enough so that I can go to this place for I guess a little early brunch or breakfast and see what it's hitting on. She told me it's called, let me see. She said Ruby something, let me see. It's called Ruby Slipper Cafe. So I'm gonna see, um, I'm gonna see how far it is walking and then um, see if I can make it before pickup because tomorrow our pickup is 127. Um, so we got a little, you know, a little time. It was supposed to be an 18 hour layover, but it got cut short. Cause like I said earlier, we were delayed um, on our first flight. Then we were delayed. Like it was just a rolling delay on all the flights. So we ended up getting here an hour later than what we were supposed to. But nonetheless, y'all know me, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it do what it do. I'm gonna make the best of it. So that's what I did. Um, that's about it. I'll give y'all a room tour in the morning. Um, Cause right now I'm about to hop in the shower and then get in the bed. Cause I'm tired, but um, yeah. So I'll talk to y'all in the morning, give y'all room tour on day two, and yeah, day two of a three day. See y'all tomorrow. Up and leave. Take a lot of courage just to live out your dreams. Bigger picture, I can see if I just close my eyes, have the foresight to believe. Good morning, good day. Today is day two of three day of a three day trip. I am up bright and early, y'all. The view from my room is amazing. Like I have the view of like the city and the river, and it is just beautiful. Like I opened the window this morning, I was like, I was just amazed at the view. So I gave y'all a little snippet of the um view but right now that's where i'm sitting i'm sitting in front of the window i'm about to do some work real quick i'm giving myself an hour to do this work and then i'm gonna go to one of these restaurants that was recommended to me to get food for lunch and then i need to come back and get ready for work so my pickup time today is at 1 27 um let me see i wrote it down yeah 127 so right now it is 10 um 10 48 so i'm giving myself an hour to do work then i'm gonna get up do my hair all that stuff go get something to eat and then come back and get dressed real quick hopefully these restaurants are not packed especially since it's only one person and then if i have to get you know get it to go then that's what i'll do but i really want to sit and eat and enjoy the vibe but you know if that doesn't work it's all it's all good that's that i um this place is just so beautiful like i'm so glad i kept this trip and like i said i kept it for a reason because i have not had a long new orleans layover and i heard our hotel is really nice which it is um and then i heard it's in a really great area not far from all the attractions and stuff and so so yeah but i need to do this work because i said a video was supposed to be posted today excuse me today is sunday and i already um said i was gonna post a video where is my work phone 
yeah so i'm supposed to be posting a video today and when i got in last night i was gonna edit but then i lied to myself i was like girl you're not doing no editing at 12 one o'clock in the morning I'm gonna do a room tour for you. So this is your door area here. You have a full length mirror ready for work. You have a closet, double door closet. It had two robes in there. Y'all know how I feel about robes. So of course one is missing because I used it. Um, you have your bathroom. Excuse the mess, let y'all know. I used the bathroom obviously, but that's me. It has a nice mirror, sink regular tub nothing spectacular about that it had two beds that's the bed i slept on that's the bed that i just put my stuff on laid there for a little bit the chair the window i told y'all i had a beautiful view let me show y'all oh almost forgot my work phone but look at the view y'all like look at that view oh my god it's so beautiful but i gotta go um that's where i was doing my work at another desk there my purse TV y'all seen this that is crazy it's old but that's what I was watching while I was doing my work um, a bar and coffee station my bags over there the refrigerators in there and that's pretty much it I am getting ready to go I didn't even do my face I didn't even go where I said I was gonna go y'all because um hold on one second because I got caught up with doing my work and when I get caught up in doing my work when I get caught up in doing my work, I get into this zone, and so I couldn't break that zone. So I was just focused on doing my work, which I still didn't finish, so I'm gonna have to edit that in between my flights today, because my goal is to have it scheduled to be put out today, either at 5 p.m. or 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I've been doing, I've been on a roll, so I just wanna continue that um, consistency. So yeah, that was that. So I didn't even get a chance to go to either of the restaurants that were recommended to me. But the good thing is, I know I'll be back and I'm definitely going to um, put that into my schedule when I come back. But I didn't even have time to do my face or anything. Put my glasses on. It's a whole natural face today. Today we have two legs. So we're going from New Orleans to Boston. That's going to be a long flight. Then we go from Boston to Tampa, another long flight. So today is going to be a pretty long day. But the good thing is we're staying on the East Coast. Minus you have an hour difference here in New Orleans, but that's not a big difference like from the West to the East. But let me go ahead and go downstairs because since I didn't get to go to the restaurants, I'm going to go downstairs and we have a free voucher for some food from the marketplace. So I'm going to get that before we head out. I have about 10 minutes to do that. So I'll talk to y'all either on the plane or in the next clip. Okay, bye. Bye. Enter here. Hello. Can I just get um what is it called? The beignets? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Um, how many come in it? Three. Can I get two uh, okay. I guess orders of it? Okay. 
Okay. Hey y'all. I've done a terrible job of vlogging this trip, but needless to say, here I am on day three. And it is technically your home day. I am in Tampa right now. Yesterday when I talked to y'all, <clears throat> which it seems like it was the only time I talked to y'all, was right before I was leaving the hotel from <clears throat> New Orleans. And we were headed to our first flight, which is which was New Orleans to Boston. And then we flew from Boston to Tampa. So, <clears throat> although yesterday was only two flights, it was a long day because both flights were um, well over 1,000 miles, which means that that I had meals to serve and it was just it was just a really long day. And luckily, we kept the same plane throughout the whole day, which was um, <clears throat> that doesn't happen often, but that was a good thing because when we got to Boston. It was a quick turn, so the cleaners came on catering, and then we loaded the passengers up and headed right back down to Florida. So now I'm in Tampa. Like I said, it is the morning time. <clears throat> it's 10:30. I literally just got back from breakfast. This hotel that we stay at, we get complimentary. <clears throat> the crews get complimentary breakfast. Um, so I did go down there to get breakfast right before they they finish because I don't miss out on free stuff. I try not to anyways. But we didn't get in last night until late. It was like 12, 12 a.m. And so I was like, I'll just pick up where I left off today, well tomorrow, which is today. And so that's what I'm doing. Also give y'all room tour because I've been to this layover but I haven't had this style of room. This is actually a nice, nice size room just for me to be here for a little bit my layover time was about 15 hours so it's good because we don't have to obviously we we're not leaving super early i get to sleep in while i slept in and um <clears throat> only bad part downside is i get home late tonight like 11 almost 12 o'clock so I did not finish, that's another thing that I didn't get to do yesterday, I did not get to finish my editing my video I said I was supposed to do and schedule for yesterday. Um, so that's what I'm about to get ready to finish doing now so that I can post it for today. I hate that because like I said I was on a roll but you know work, work comes first so <clears throat> yeah and then I think I'm going to go out after I'm finished editing, um, because I need to go to the store to get me some stuff. And I believe it's like maybe not even 10 minute walk. So I'm going to finish this and then I'll come back and talk to y'all. I said I was also going to go to the pool. So I'm going to see if I walk to the store and then I come back, chill at the pool for a little bit, then come back up and get ready. So let's see if I could do all that within the next couple of hours. I don't have to leave here until like 2 it's like two, two something. So I have time. I have plenty of time. All right, bye. Hey y'all. So it is later on in the afternoon. I am getting ready for work. Got my hair wrapped and I'm still working on this video y'all. So y'all wouldn't believe it, but the Wi-Fi at this hotel is horrible. It said it was going to take like two and a half hours to upload my, on YouTube to upload my video. And I'm like, that's stupid. Um, so I ended up staying here in the room. I didn't go, like I said, I was going to walk to the store. I ended up Instacarting what I needed to get. And um, that came really quick. But I didn't want to leave and not finish my video. So the good thing is that I finished my video. I finished it way early because I was almost done anyways from yesterday. But it's just the fact of this Wi-Fi really sucks here. So I just checked it again and it says it has like 20 minutes left. But I have to leave here within like the next five minutes. So I say all that to say I'm going to have to figure out how to upload the video. 
Um, I'm clearing out the stuff out of the refrigerator. Oh, real quick. I gotta go because I'm running late. Um, but let me do a room tour for y'all real quick. So, this is a door here. When you walk in, and I'm gonna just turn around. So, you have a little kitchen area there. Um, I think this is a closet. Yeah, like a little pantry. This is really like a little apartment, honestly. And then you walk in, you have your living room area, a TV, the nice full length mirror. I need to change my shoes. I told y'all, working on that. You have a whole little desk area and a foyer area there. You have the closet, which is a pretty nice size too, by the way. Tom is it, I gotta go. Then you have the bathroom, which is just a regular standard bathroom. Nothing spectacular. The mirror, I need my glasses because I can't see without that. But yeah, LED mirror, pretty cool. Um, then you walk in and you have the bedroom. So one bed, big window, suitcase there, and then the TV. So yeah, pretty much that is it. I'm gonna go ahead and head downstairs because I, uh oh, what time is it? Oh, I got like five minutes to get down there. So I need to pack up my laptop and head downstairs, take this thing off my head and I will see y'all when I get on the plane and update y'all then. Bye. That's not. getting back home a lot later than what I was tonight. I'm not too excited about it, so me and the crew are just chilling in these seats here because we're waiting for a pilot that hasn't even left their destination yet, so yeah, the wonderful life, and it's go home day at that, so I guess I'll update y'all on the next update. Taking time.